right. On the hunt for creepy things and stuff that keeps us up at night, I must creep myself out. I must have nightmares. Very small channel. I found David Shedler. Shedler. It looked like this could be pretty creepy. Let's see what this is about. What lurks in the park after midnight. My name is Bailey Morris, and I'm a murderer. Oh, wow. It's a secret I've kept for over 20 years. Well, the scene of the crime, right here in this park. Today's the day. You're coming out with it. I'm all right. Memory. It was after midnight. My best friend Maddie and I had snuck out and met here at our favorite place. We've done it several times before, yeah, nice. feeling like teenage rebels with not a care in the world that summer. Maddie was the daredevil of our duo, ready to jump into anything, the consequences be damned. <laughs> it's funny, at that age, you feel bulletproof. The thought of anything terrible happening to you is an impossibility. You really do. You really do at that age. How wrong we were that night. The world is so big, and you are invincible. Oh my god. Oh, it's just a kitty somewhere. Where's the kitty? Uh, oh, wait a second. No, that's not a cat at all. I'm, I'm gonna puke. Yep, <laughs> that's the right idea. Get the hell out of there immediately. Oh, uh, these, these guys are smart enough to know not to stick around. We ran for our lives, but Maddie was slower than me. Oh, no. And slower than the creature. No, Maddie! Maddie screamed as the creature dragged her away. Oh, no. I should have gone back for her to try and save her, but I was terrified and kept running. Zero I ran all the way life, home man. and snuck back expect? into my room. Maddie's screams still echoing in my head. Oh, poor Maddie. She seemed like such a nice The next morning, kid, Maddie's yeah. parents found her bed empty. Fearing a kidnapping, they called the police immediately. Search teams were organized, flyers were printed up, and the girl who had vanished without a trace was the lead story on the news that night. Wait, she thinks she's a murderer because she didn't it save her friend? It seems the whole town turned out to help search for Maddie. That's crazy. But I knew they would never find her. You're running for your her. life. She was dead, and it was my fault. Why didn't I go back for her? Ugh. You wouldn't have helped. Days you just would have got yourself killed too, you crazy. Weeks turned into months. Don't let the guilt get you. The missing posters Fortunate. became worn and tattered and eventually taken down. We had a candlelight vigil for Maddie on the anniversary of her oh, disappearance. Maddie. I couldn't even look at Maddie's parents because I knew their girl was never coming home. I don't think that qualifies. It's you been as a 20 murderer, years though. now I've been I keeping my secret. Some bad luck. I've never told anyone what really happened to Maddie because who would believe me? Hmm. Would you? I don't know. A creature that grabs somebody away. Hey, that's a tough one. That's a tough call. But we saw a, we saw a creature meowing like a cat and then running after somebody and terminating him. Nightmare fuel achieved. I'm going to remember that meow. That is for sure. That was, that was unsettling at best. David Shedler is the channel. If you enjoyed this one, I definitely recommend giving his channel a peek and seeing what else he's got because it looks like he's got some potential here for some other creepy stuff and that is what I'm about. Thanks for watching.